Okay. I don't see a way across. Huh. Redstone blocks, some pistons. Wonder what this thing's supposed to be. Hello? Anyone? Olivia, is that you? Jesse! There you are. <coughs> I thought I'd never find you. Have you found a way out of here? A way out? I only just found you! This maze? We don't have time for this. Who even knows where the others are by now? I mean, the clock's ticking here, Jesse. Well, at least we're back together. Yes, the Dream Team reunited. <laughs> now the Dream Team's just gotta find a way across this gaping bottomless pit. What about this thing? Could it get us across? It's some kind of flying barge. It would probably get us to the other side. But it's in really bad shape. And it's really complicated. You can fix it though, right? I don't know. I think it's out of my league. I wish I'd had more time to study with Eligard. It can't be that complicated. Not if it's something Ivor built. Half built. Which means it was hard enough that he got stuck and gave up. This layout doesn't even make any sense. What was Ivor thinking? Or maybe it's just me. I mean, Eligard herself said I don't have what it takes to be a great engineer. She was right, I just can't hack it. Who cares what she said? I do! She's the greatest Redstone engineer ever. She's in the Order of the Stone. Sure, but the Order are still people. Just like us. Right. Just like us. I mean, how are we the ones saving the world when even they don't have what it takes? Soren and Ivor are always at each other's throats. The greatest warrior in history has wither sickness. None of them give Eligard any respect. And Magnus lost his life trying to fight this. If the Order can't do this, how are we supposed to? How are we supposed to do anything? All I know is, the world is depending on us. Then maybe the world is in trouble. I mean... They defeated an Ender Dragon. Can you name even one thing we've done right? Well, we won that building contest at Endercon. That was a contest, Jesse. Right. And the competition was stiff. Just think what we can do when there's nobody even watching. I like that way of looking at it. Ah! All right, I'll try it one more time. Wait a second. I think I see what he was trying to do. Jesse, take this piston, craft it into a sticky piston, then place it on the other side of the barge, along with a redstone block. You got all that? I think so. Hey, Olivia. You put the block and piston on the barge yet? No. Well, this thing won't start without them. Then I'll get right on it. The sooner the better.
Okay, let's put the redstone block where it's supposed to go and place these pistons. We did it! We need flint and steel to get it started. I'm proud of you, Olivia. Thanks, Jesse. And thanks for everything you said just before. It really helped. No problemo. <laughs> this way! This way! Run! Everybody get on! Quick! Onto the barge! moment slime i'm remembering something with slime and ch chickens or maybe they were ducks yes that's how we got to gabriel after his keynote speech weird yeah i kind of remember wait Ugh, it's already fading fading and on. take my advice petra some stories are better left forgotten Lands is nothing to laugh about. Let's go see what he's hiding in there. <laughs> 